everyone welcome back to my channel so today i have another brand new die set in front of me i've put it just under some cards so you can see a bit better i have actually used it this one is called the seasonal friends treat box die set and oh my goodness you're gonna have so much fun with this one it creates the most adorable characters that you then put on a box you can easily use them as um card toppers you can actually create um a hanging ornament like a bauble there is a die that you can um use to add the bauble top it's uh let me have a look because i've used it i don't know how tonic do this just pack everything up so neatly and once i've taken them out i find it so hard because there's, there's literally so many dies in this collection so yeah here's the little bauble topper just on the top there so with this die set you can create um, a witch, a reindeer, Santa, snowman, um, I think a penguin. You can use the eyes and the contents, even a little bunny rabbit. You can use the contents of this and create whatever characters you want. You're going to get full instructions with your die set. You also get this stamp set. Let me just grab another piece of paper. Um, so yeah, with this stamp set, you can... Um, stamp out the eyes you've got sentiments here merry christmas happy easter easter wishes happy holidays trick or treat and happy halloween so obviously you can then coordinate your um, sentiment with your box or your card topper or your bauble i've already made a couple which i'm going to put this aside and i'm going to show you there's also some sentiments um, that you can die cut as well so let me show you what i made so the first one was this a reindeer box and oh my goodness look at his face so this one i've put merry christmas i've used one of the recent collections from tonic studios so if you have the paper collections definitely use them they lend themselves really well to decorating but all these little details i have actually foam padded them up so you get a bit of dimension on the face the, it's just so cute look at the scarf the eyes have stamped out and then the antlers they're just just so cute and then i've embossed the merry christmas with a stamp here on some red card so this is my reindeer and it stands up like this really really cute and then i also made a witch look at my angry witch <laughs> but she came out so so adorable like i love the hat and then i've used some elements from a recent die set from tonic i've put a happy halloween on there on some purple card i've distressed it with some black ink i've embossed some green card with an old embossing folder and then again i've distressed it i've added a little spider a cobweb from a recent die set and then her hair is just it's just so much fun so i've laid loads of these little pieces up this is a die that is actually in the set i've gone around the back as well because i didn't want her to have not any hair on the back and um yeah so the face uh, the nose is in the die set the, this is a stamp and i've stamped the eyes and i've actually cut the eyebrows from one of the dies that's in the set as well so just super super adorable and then lastly i actually made a little bauble and this one is a snowman one so isn't this so cute so you get this little section here which you can thread your twine your ribbon through and in fact if you didn't want to have all this you can just use it as a top on a card so i've added all these details for my snowman um, I've just got some leaves to create like um, holly leaves and some berries on there but all these extra layers are in the die set and on the back I've just um, added a little sentiment from my stash so really really cute you, there are dies and obviously the stamps that you can use for the eyes but I've gone in with some black um, drops in there because it looks really nice and glossy and I've added some of these snowflake um, confetti from tonic studios as well so really really cute die set i'll put the link in the description box to where you can go and find this today but yeah definitely don't miss out i hope i've given you a bit of inspiration but these are going to be so much fun to create so thank you so much for watching and i will see you all very soon take care bye